subscribe. Hi. <laughs> Hello, everyone out there. You watching Bad Breath TV? Hi, everyone. Take all the time you need, baby. <clears throat> what up? I'm Ginger Vitus. I'm Buck Russell, aka Uncle. So you might have heard of the uh, Travis Scott meal from McDonald's. I'm sure you have. Everyone's talking about it. It's all over the social medias. It's, it's all over everywhere. It's in my emails. Did you know Travis Scott isn't the only person with a fast food burger? He's not. You just have to know how to order them and where to go. You didn't know that, you stupid idiot. But we're going to teach you. We're going to educate you, you on it. You big dummy. We're going to take you from a big dummy to a big smarty. <laughs> so you know how to order these burgers from your favorite joint. Turns out there's some items you can order off menu. Everyone has secret menus. Travis Scott, we know you're not the only one. You're not the only one. Shame on you. Shame on you. Shame. Shame, shame. Shame, shame. shame, shame. And now we're going to start it off and get into the first fast food wrap burger you didn't know you could find. You fucking idiot. <laughs> and now we're gonna get into the first fast food wrap burger you didn't know you could find. Dude, you're so stupid. I can, <laughs> you're so stupid. I can hit you right in the mouth. Alrighty, first up we have Arby's with the Future uh, Roast Beef Slider. You know how much Future likes his roast beef. Wink. And to order this, you gotta say, she belongs to the streets. Yes, that's correct. You go up to your um, Arby's drive through and you say, hey, she belongs to the streets. Excuse me, ma'am or sir, she belongs to the streets. And they'll whip this purple uh, looking sandwich up for you right away. And by the way, uh, I'm not exactly sure why it's so purple. I, it no looks like it comes with a nice, nice looking sauce. So I can only imagine, I think. We should we should dabble it off with a little more on oh, top. Interesting. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. A little au jus. Au Arby is known for its au jus it's sauces. It's true. It's like a French dip. Yeah. Right. Okay. We'll dip. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so. All right. All right. Let's. All right. Well, that looks delicious. <laughs> that looks it? fantastic. So, cheers. Cheers. Uh, the future uh, roast beef, beef slider. slider. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> wow. What did we do? <laughs> what the fuck? Why do we start with this one? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I ruined my day. I have no clue what Arby's is thinking with this one. I'm going to swallow it. No. Oh, my God. Let me go ahead and censor this. Put a censor bar over that. I'm sorry for spitting that out. That's disgusting. <laughs> Yeah, you fuck, you done fucked up, Arby's. Uh, I don't listen to Future, but maybe, hey, maybe if you like Future, you check out this. You go up to your local Arby's and you say, hey, she belongs to the streets. You check out, I still don't, is this cough syrup? Here we have our next Sandwich. It looks delicious. I don't know if you're seeing that from where we're looking, but it looks fucking delicious. You, you smell that? I'm smelling. I'm smelling hints of spicy chicken. I'm smelling spice. hints of maple, maybe. This is the mystical shake your ass Popeyes chicken sandwich. What? These, if you if you if you didn't notice here, we have a, a beautiful crisp 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 crisp. Spicy chicken sandwich laid softly in between uh, a jelly donut with maple glazing. That Popeyes actually make themselves. Pa what? Your Popeyes doesn't make donuts? You dumb, dumb, dummy. Your Popeyes makes donuts. You just are you, too stupid to know You gotta it. know how to ask for them. So this so. is uh, the mystical shake your ass special. You gotta walk up to the counter. You, you gotta say, shake the ass. Watch yourself. Shake the ass. Show me what you're working with. Shh. Don't, shh, don't tell them where you heard this from. Shh, we're not supposed to tell Keep you. Keep it quiet. Keep it quiet. Don't tell anybody. Whisper. I'm really excited. We gotta just dig in. Let's dig into this bad boy. I can't boy. wait any longer. Cheers, my brethren. Cheers. <laughs> okay. Papa knew what he was doing here. See, this is a hit. This is good. It's spicy. It's chicken. Hey. It's donuts. Um, we're gonna have to take a second because we're gonna have to finish these real quick. 
Oh, you thought you didn't sign up for an ASMR channel? To perpetuate your own shaking of the ass, you need to eat a lot of these sandwiches. It keeps your ass nice and plump. So, shouts to Mystical. That's a great sandwich right there. Shouts to Mystical. Oh, y'all plans have been right now with the place to be. Eating this spicy Popeye chicken Mystical made for me. <laughs> Shake that ass. Watch this song. Shake that ass. Working with. That shit was delicious. We're heading on to the next one. Your favorite redheaded fast food icon collabed with your favorite neon rainbow hair rat. And he got himself a sandwich at Wendy's. Um, and the sandwich looks pretty interesting. Hey, I'm not looking forward to it. <laughs> Nine uh, gummo rat burger with a uh, special house made horseradish sauce. Horse rat ish sauce. And and a little spicy. Mm. A little bit of lettuce in a big old rat. Rat, yes. So um, I guess for me it's gonna be bottoms up, right? I'm gonna dig right into that head. So <laughs> go ahead and get yourself some head, boy. <laughs> Let's get it. Oh, I can smell the horseradish. <laughs> That's not that's not a flavor combo that shit is this. <laughs> that's not good. Mm. Nice nice tender bun. Um yeah, that's disgusting. Yeah. That's offensive to my senses, just like uh Six Nine's music. Sorry, I'm very sorry to Dave Thomas. Who's Dave Thomas? Who's Dave Thomas? Is that like the drummer for the Foo Fighters? <laughs> <laughs> the founder of Wendy's is Dave Thomas. That was close. Gucci Mane Burger from Dairy Queen. With cheese, because he's all about that money. Gotta get that cheddar. That cheddar. Look, these are very innovative on how you get to carry them. What we have here is a burger on a stick that also has ice cream. You hold it from the bottom. The Gucci Mane Burger. A little bit of ice cream, a little bit of burger. A little ice cream, a little burger. I'm sure Gucci may never had any white stuff on his nose. His was probably a little bit more powdery. Well, oh, no, this is a pretty good burger. It's very nice. It's fun to hold. Yeah. This is the best of both worlds. Mm -hmm. If you want a little bit of dessert, you get some ice cream. If you want a little more hearty, you get yourself a piece of the burger. Mm -hmm. And then when you're done with the burger, you can, you can kind of... <laughs> so, um... Those are all really good. They're pretty good, you know? They, it's, just fast, it's fast food, right? Fast food can only be so good. The next one, the last one for today, this rapper is a man who, who likes a little higher quality in his food, his entertainment. So we thought it was only right uh, that we make it ourselves. So this is not available, of course. It would be silly if this next one was available at fast food. We're making it ourselves. Uh, in the honor of our Bam Bam Baklava. Bam Bam Baklava, Action Bronson. Action Bronson. <laughs> we're gonna make ourselves a burger. And we're it's, making it ourselves. And it's gonna be a gourmet burger. Oh, Ashante. High quality. We got some Kobe beef we flew in from Japan. Go ahead and tell the people. Tell the people about the layers. The layers of flavor. We got some Kobe beef from Japan. Mm-hmm. Layer one. We got some prosciutto from Italy flown in. We got some mysterious cheese that I don't even know what it's called. Manchego. We're gonna have some caramel onions on there. Caramel onions, not caramelized onions. We have actual <coughs> caramel onions. That we caramel made. onions. It's gonna have a nice little mango barbecue with some sort of reduction sauce. And then it's also gonna have some homemade baklava that I'm, that we're gonna make ourselves. I'm not gonna do it. Who made? Who's gonna make it? All right, I'm gonna make all of it myself. Baklava is a very hard treat to make. I'm not making that shit. I'm gonna shred the baklava. I'm not even gonna just clean myself up. 
ice cream and all on my face. I'm gonna get right to it. Mm -hmm. All right, so we are here. Chef Uncle over here whipped us up a nice little, a nice little Bam Bam special. Um, this is a nice little cross section of it. I got onions in my hair. We gotta it's dig in. It's about to get spicy, I can feel it. <coughs> so I guess we should just pick it up and... Damn, dude, let's fucking go, look at this. Cheers. Boom. I gotta eat right next to the mic, so I'm really sorry. This is about to be gross. This is a really good burger, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's good. Damn. Wow. The baklava on there is surprisingly really good. Yeah. Why? <laughs> this is an amazing burger. It's kind of sweet. It's kind of spicy. <laughs> it's in every element. What the fuck? <sighs> Not much to say here, folks. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Yep. Hit that subscribe. Hit that like button. Hope you guys are all doing good. Staying safe out there. If you watch this late in the video, then you're a fucking real one, so. Shout out to you, I love you. Love you. Maybe tell your friends about us. A lot more content coming on YouTube. Just make sure you subscribe. Damn, you finished? I don't even know if I can finish all this. It's too big of a burger for me. I got the spirit of Bam Bam in me. Francelino! Make sure you guys, you guys go. Get yourself a nice wrapper fast food burger. Travis Scott is not the only one. He isn't. I would highly recommend you make this burger at home. Yeah, you can't find that one anywhere. That one's, that one's fire. I think we just tried harder at that than we've ever tried at anything in our lives. <laughs> we fucking nailed it. Bad rap TV. Like a